Welcome back to America's Got Talent. Whoever wins next week will be headlining a spectacular show in Las Vegas. It will be held at the Venetian Palazzo starting September 26th and will include some of your favorite acts from this season. For info and tickets, go to NBC.com slash AGT. Next up, fighting for a spot in the finals, a singer who's had the audience and the judges on their feet every time he's performed. From Mill Valley, California, it's Tim Hockenberry. Everything I hope for. When you sing with such emotion. You are a phenomenal talent. Before AGT came around this year, I really was considering just giving up, not playing music anymore for a living. I guess I wasn't supposed to give up. Since I've been sober, it's just nice to keep putting my best foot forward, you know, and sort of doing the next right thing. If you do the next right thing enough days in a row, life gets pretty good, and I want to get to the finals. Out of all the singers we've seen, Tim Hockenberry's my favorite. But take a look at all the talent tonight. This is the year that the singers are getting knocked off one by one. He's gonna have a hard time tonight. I'm worried about the competition. Everyone seems so good. I don't have a lot of props. I don't have a lot of crazy effects. I show up with an instrument and I show up with my voice. And hopefully that's enough for America. There's no heaven It's easy if you try No hell below us Above us only sky Imagine all I'm a dreamer But I'm not the only one I hope someday you'll join us And the world It will live as one Yes, we can live as one. Incredible. Outstanding, man. Mr. Mandel. Well, uh, Tim. There's no denying that you are a fabulous singer, and I can listen to you all night long, and I would certainly go out and buy any recordings that you do. But here's what I have to say. Knowing where we are in this competition and the fact that I know what's even coming up tonight, as Howard said in the package beforehand, being a singer kind of plays against you because there's so much, you know, amazing original competition. Not that what you're doing is not original, but it isn't in the sense that you're singing. You sound a little bit like Joe Cocker to me and Michael Grimm, who, uh, Joe who? <laughs> and, and, and Michael Grimm. It's just that gritty voice we've heard before. I love it, but I don't know if it's original enough to take it to the next step. Sharon. Yeah. What I loved about your performance tonight was the simplicity. You know, every, as you said, everybody's got, there's lights flashing, people are flying around in the air, and yours was a very true, refreshing performance for me. I thoroughly enjoyed it. Howard Stern, as a music lover, you stood up. You gave him a standing ovation. I sure did. This was the most moving performance we've had from a singer in a long time. Now look, let's get real already. 
He's right. No props, no effects. He chose a great accompaniment with the cello. That guy was excellent. You chose a song that moves everyone, and you went back to sounding like yourself. Unlike what Nick said in the beginning, I didn't think your last performance was great. This tonight was great because you went back to sounding like the Tim Hockenberry that I love. And I think you do deserve a place in the finals. And every time I hear that song, and I have to say this, I think about that jackass who murdered John Lennon. I hope he rots in jail forever. I really, truly do. That is one of the most beautiful songs, and you did it justice, and good for you. Thank you. Imagine John Lennon. That's a, that's a big song. Why did you choose it? Um, I chose a song because it's an epic song, and uh, as John Lennon asks, you know, imagine a world without greed and hunger. Um, I think those are two things that we have too much of in this world, but I think America gets it right more, more times than anyone else. So I'm glad to be here. Thank you. All right, America, you heard Tim. To put Tim Hockenberry into the finals, you know what you have to do. Call 1-866-60-AGT-08. That's 1-866-60-24808. All of the acts need you. I got one word for you. Vote. Coming up. This week, our dance is really, really hard. And I hope the judges like what we're going to show them tonight. There's a lot of sword fighting in this. It's got to be perfection for it to be pulled off.